We've also been watching progress at a very different address, one of the most famous in Canada, 24 Sussex. It's supposed to be where the Prime Minister lives, but as long as Justin Trudeau has held government, the historic home has sat empty, waiting for much-needed renovations. Tonight, CTV News has learned the real costs of maintaining the house, even when no one calls it home. CTV's Annie Bergeron-Oliver has the exclusive details. When Prime Minister Justin Trudeau decided not to live in 24 Sussex, most expected it was so renovations could begin. But four years later, sources tell CTV News there are no concrete plans and no new contracts issued for work on the Heritage Home. It is the home of the most significant person of our executive, but unfortunately what it represents now is demolition by neglect. Documents obtained by CTV News detail the urgent repairs required, from severe window problems to electrical and plumbing systems beyond their life cycle, and a pool building that's not usable and needs to be rebuilt. While the government weighs its options, the cost to maintain the cracking asbestos-filled building are rising. Since 2015, the government has spent more than $2.3 million in upkeep. That includes $370,000 on utilities, more than $1.3 million on extra security, and more than $580,000 on snow and ice removal and regular maintenance, including thousands on weekly pool maintenance. Just like Trudeau, who lived at 24 Sussex as a child. Catherine Clark also called it home when her father, Joe Clark, was Prime Minister. There is a real argument to be made at this point for tearing it down and rebuilding from scratch with um, all Canadian materials, Canadian designers and architects, make it environmentally sustainable. The cost of renovation has been pegged at at least $34 million, and that doesn't include the necessary security upgrades. One Privy Council memo warns there is likely to be strong interest from stakeholders and potential negative reaction to cost implications. Hello. Like Prime Ministers before him, Trudeau does not appear to be in a rush to renovate. No Prime Minister wants to be seen uh, spending the money on themselves, but the reality is this building is not going to fix itself. The Prime Minister's office, the RCMP and the National Capital Commission, among other agencies, all have a say in what happens to 24 Sussex and sources leases to say it's hard to get things done when nobody is making this property a priority. Interesting. All right, Annie, I see they've got their Christmas wreaths out there, though.